I will always continue to cry for the teachers. He who feels it knows it. The teachers are suffering. We are here enjoying the AC. Some of them are down there at Bolivar now. Where they are sleeping is not conducive. But the politicians care not. I will continue for, to call for their allowance to be increased. Especially hardship allowance. Because most of the teachers will want to stay within greater Banjul areas. So hardship allowance still need to be increased. But if teachers are not well paid, how can they perform better? And in fact, some of them will complain that in the upper part of the country, it is hot. I believe that the Gambia is our country and wherever you are posted to, you should go. But then they should enjoy special treatment or special allowance that will motivate them to go to the provinces. Because those children that are in Basse, they also deserve better treatment too. They are all children of this beloved country. And we should not expect the good teachers to remain here. I will continue to call on the government to provide them, especially through the Ministry of Basic and Secondary Education, to come up with something like clothing allowance for teachers, to better their life at least. Most of the government sectors or departments are receiving clothing allowance, but the teachers are not receiving clothing allowance. Can we think of way forward? The Ministry of Basic and Secondary Education is still hanging. And I don't know how much will we add to the Ministry of Basic and Secondary Education. I think we can do more because they are renting other offices and also they want to create the deputy directorate throughout the country. So whatever we can do to help them uh, is in our interest because all of us here have children that are going to school. But what is funny at times, the politicians will choose to take their children to private schools. But because we destroy the public schools, so we will not send our children to the public school, but instead we will send them to the private schools, So, which is very sad. I think a policy or, 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 or a bill should be passed restricting members of the National Assembly and ministers and all other guys not to send their children to private schools. We all send them to public schools. While I say the budget is humiliating and disgracing is because the budget did not capture in any way to increase the salaries of our teachers, did not capture in any way to increase the allowances of the civil servants generally in the country. And I believe the cost of living is escalating day in, day out. If the cost of living was controlled, for instance, like, like the, the escalating in price was controlled, at least it would have been better.